All right, Cassidy, 11 lead changes, 13 ties. Jason Tatum getting a second technical, called for a flagrant foul. So Robert Covington hit three free throws at the end of the third to give Philadelphia the lead. Holiday's left-handed shot, no good. Rebounded by K.J. Martin. Here's DeAnthony Melton in transition. Can't score, but there's Bamba. Big minutes off the bench for Mo Bamba tonight. Hobbling a bit, though, as he comes back down the floor. Yeah, he tweaked his ankle a little bit, but like you said, huge minutes. That's two follow dunks, two threes. He's given him a big boost here in the second half. 8 nothing. Philadelphia run. So Tatum is out, as we mentioned. And in case you're just joining us, Joel Embiid not playing due to illness for the second straight game. Tyrese Maxey warmed up. He's not playing because of illness. Nicholas Batum, who had been starting, is out because of injury. Melton's three, no good. Cato with the rebound. Well, this is all that Nick Nurse could ask for. Up four, more than he could ask for. They have a chance to win this game, Dave. And you got first place in the East on the line. Peyton Pritchard. But Beverly started the game seven of eight. He's still eight of 11, 18 points. Provided a great spark. Misses badly. Will they count the putback uh, by Bomber? Is it a foul on the Beverly drive? I, I think it's in a breast. And they'd come in with their second unit. They'd beat people. And it was so demoralizing. And it was so positive for them. And if the Sixers can pull this out, it looks nice, nice job by Pitcher there. It's almost like two, three wins, even though it only counts as one, because it's overcoming a huge deficit in your personnel. That gets Boston back within a point. Kata with four points, three rebounds in eight minutes, third year out of Utah State. 2.15 gone by. Bamba, you got to get out on him. They didn't there, but he missed it. He made two in the third. Kata with the rebound. Drew Holley looking to drive again, and Kata's fouled. And they just have not been taking a lot of shots from the perimeter. Jalen Brown, he's been on the bench for a while. Yep. Struggled with his shot, taking maybe some ill-advised shots. He's been on the bench since about three minutes to go in the third. Melton into traffic, knocked away by Holiday, his specialty. So good at that, just fighting down there on the block. Pritchard throws a three. Harris loses the ball. Pritchard looking to run. Kata and call for the other side as well. At 16 turnovers by the Celtics. Covington got it every time. It looks like Boston might pull away. Philly comes back with a big hit. That was another big one. Covington with 18 points. Three of five from three. Game tied at 104. Four minutes in. Here's Pritchard, he's got the hot hand. Not that time, Kata with position underneath. Harris who's played 30 with the steal, Beverly's played 30. And Beverly's not used to playing no. that many minutes. Harris penetrates, missed the shot. Bamba couldn't get the tip, and Horford couldn't save it. Yeah. Stay with Philly. Nick Nerd. Nine players have uh, been on the court tonight for Philadelphia. That's it. Melton, nice move off the window. Melton with 21, and Philly back in front with five quick points. They're, they're attacking Hauser. He's got a big gash on his neck. I don't know when he got that. He, as great as he is on offense, the, the real liability with Hauser is the defense, and, the, and Philly's trying to exploit that. Hauser with the back cut, but knocked away by Covington. Melton lobs it ahead to Harris, gets the deep catch, Ooh. and the swap. Horford, and another block. Horford at age 37, up high twice to send Harris back. And then a foul call uh, by the Celtics at the rim. As you said, Melton with five. He's got to stay on the court, though. Shot clock down to six. Horford penetrates, throws to the corner, and the up one. Philadelphia playing without its two best players that average a combined 60 points per game. Yet, they're hanging in there against the Celtics, who've beaten teams by 19 points per game at home this year. Harris is fouled by Jalen Brunson to three threes already in the fourth after just one in the third. 12 in the first half. Harris 
can't connect. He's gone cold after a great start. Loose ball. Covington bodies it the floor. And Derek White comes away with it for Boston. White driving on Reed. Gets the layup at the left hand. Smart move that time by White. So poised. You know, just so, so solid. Always love having the ball in his hands. He's got 21, matching Tatum, who has been ejected. Got a second technical at the end of the third. Philly just three for 12 from the floor in the quarter. Fade away <laughs> by Paul Reed. He is fearless tonight. I mean, does he have these moves? That's what I want. I'm going to ask their GM, Daryl Moore, is this who Paul Reed is? And we just don't know it. But that's, those are tough shots. Six or seven from the field. It's a great night for Paul. Taking advantage of his first start of the season with Embiid out. Shot clock at eight. Pritchard got a couple threes already here in the quarter. Working on Harris. Gets down the lane. Draws the foul on Harris. And will shoot two. The Celtics leading the Sixers by three. Third of four meetings between the two. They split the first two in Philly. Melton misses the layup. Fortunate bounce, but Covington blew the putback. And a loose ball foul called That's on Melton. Yeah, if it's Melton, he's time since the Celtics have had a five-point lead. Largest lead for them was eight. Largest deficit was seven. There's Beverly. And he puts it up and in with the floater. He's got 22 points. That's his signature shot right there, that running floater. He looks, it's a tough shot, but he's practiced it, and he can make that shot. Makes it quite a bit. Horford off the screen, gets the pitch back. He'll try a three. In and out for Horford. Horford had two early threes. He's got 16 points on the night. I got Holiday, great on ball defender working on Morris, and he'll switch now out to Beverly. Morris, smaller defender on him. Here comes the help. Shot clock down to three, so Beverly goes down the lane, missed it, batted out, and Harris tracks it down. And a fresh 14 seconds. And falling violation on Tobias Harris. That was frustrating. I mean, 